I know the Semedo is not he's not playing because he's he's, he's he's with Ghana, which again it's not just Liverpool have been affected by the African Cup and they're Ghana missing, aren't they? Uh, so, yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, yeah. it's 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 gonna be a I think it's, 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 <laughs> I think I, you deserved it. Hello and welcome to the latest Blood Red podcast from the Liverpool Echo. I'm Joe Rimmer and joining me today is Ian Doyle. How are you, Ian? How yeah, okay you? I'm all right, I'm all right. We're on the round table with Paul Ghost as well. Paul, how are you? All good, yeah. I am looking forward to a Long round trip on Sunday with Doyley, Bournemouth yeah. and back in a day. <laughs> I've done I've done Bournemouth and back in a day with Doyley. Do you have actually? Yeah, yeah. Doyley, it was yeah, Everton, yeah. wasn't it? Yeah. yeah Everton, yeah. Wasn't yeah, that the day yeah. that somebody recognised you and then halfway got halfway through the conversation <laughs> was... and realised you weren't the person they thought? No, you no, were. no, no. That was um, I hope they're not listening, but that that was quite embarrassing. Really. <laughs> it was in the services, wasn't it? And um, he said, "Joe," I said, "Hi," and he said, "We went to uni together." <laughs> I must admit, I could not remember it. Mm-hmm. Anyway, before we continue, I, I just want to quickly touch upon a conversation we were just having before we came on air. If you could put Ian Doyle in any wrestling hold, Paul Ghost, yeah. which one would you put him in? Um, probably <clears throat> the um, the Lion Tamer, which is slightly different to the Walls of Jericho. Wow, showing his knowledge. So it's the one with that, that's where you put the knee into the back and you really put the put the hitting on them. So I'd, I'd like to put those. He, and he couldn't do that to you because like <clears> you're <throat> a big man, so he couldn't get you over. Yeah, no, you? no one could do that to him. There's no, no one no. on our sports desk that'd be able be, to do that. He'd be tapping. Yeah, it'd be yeah. tapping. What, what would you put, um, Paul? In? Close line, obviously. I'd have to jump up for it. I'd have to jump back. What do you say, for him? He's still a move from a hold. Figure that leg lock in tribute to Ric Flair. Can you imagine that? <laughs> Let us know in the comments which wrestling hold you'd like to put Ian Doyle in. I, I'd like to put him in many. Yeah, it depends yeah. on the day, really. Sharp shoes, uh, sharp shoes would be well, good. As, as, we, as, we know from, yeah. sorry, yeah. as we know yeah. from the podcast on Monday, you're quite small, so I'd imagine you'd be wow. you'd be yeah. open to all of them, I think. I said to you before, I'm going to go back to back Maybe with any man. Just even a, a yeah. good old-fashioned headlock. Yeah, just yeah. a headlock. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm sure you've had them in a few of them. It doesn't look a terrible one, but, but when Mohamed Salah goes off the pitch... This is a man who doesn't get substitution many yeah. times, doesn't get injured. I think the last I read the last injury he had for Liverpool was 2019. That's is that incorrect. sound right? That's is it incorrect, incorrect is it? because he went off injured in the FA Cup final. Yes. Oh, well, forgot about yeah. that. Okay. Forgot about that. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, thank you for correcting me. But still, okay. quite a while. It's 2022. It's only so. less than two years. 18 months ago. All right. All right. Well, 20 months. He doesn't came, go off the pitch. So the point yeah. stands. He doesn't go off in many. Yeah. So you know when Mohamed Salah goes off the pitch, that it, it used it, it should be. Serious. I know the Semedo is not. He's not playing because he's he's with, he's, he's with Ghana. Which again, it's not just Liverpool have been affected by the African Cup and African Cup nations. Him, aren't they? Uh, so, yeah, yeah. It's, 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 yeah. it's 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 gonna be a. It's, 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 <laughs> I think I think you deserved it because yeah. you went too early with that. To be yeah. fair, you, you should have built it up a little bit more. Um, so yeah, Bournemouth tricky, but yeah, it's as I said, it's not just Liverpool are missing the missing the uh, players from the from the tournament. You've quite pleased with that, aren't you? <laughs> it's it's like, you're, you're, you're just, I know what you'll do. You'll say, oh, it's awful. In the next pod when Ghana play, he'll slip it in and try and claim it. As yeah, we've well, done, we've, do, do, you, you forget how long I've been doing this job. We've done all these to deck already. The best conference today, though, that you, you would have been happy with, but you, you decided you weren't because they weren't your jokes. Which one was they? When we were talking about the cushions. Oh, yeah, that's that was... That's just fellow talk, that. <laughs> that's a good one. Yeah, yeah, I'd high five you for that, but you... you just he got me. a straight red instead. He got a straight red. Mm. Because they were red. Anyway, going back to the podcast... What, what's Klopp's favourite word? I don't know. The... You've written about it a lot recently. Uh, f- rhythm. Rhythm. Oh, rhythm. Rhythm, yeah, yeah sorry, and yeah. Think, yeah. And I think she's thrown us there. Yeah, I think Joe Gomez is, like, the standard bearer in that squad for... Rhythm, for, yeah. For Klopp's. Kurt, Curtis yeah. Jones, the other one. Yeah, there's, there's yeah, a few yeah. in there. I think actually, that's a good point. It was interesting listening to, to Pep Linders just mm. the day before the Fulham game, where he said anyone who had negativity at pre-season, the beginning of the pre-season, would get a punch in the face because we were leaving all that behind and yeah. it was a fresh start. You know, everyone you know, great going again. Place practice. No, I mean it's pro- probably assaulting <laughs> the employees. Yeah. It's, it's not great. Yeah. I mean. Did you want to do that with Theo? Well, after his reading last week, yeah. <laughs> Stick though, he had a few yeah. wrestling moves. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah, exactly, yeah. You're quite yeah. violent, aren't you, yeah. really? Well, I don't know, the, the sharpshooter, I think. I won't make a complaint to HR if I see you put the uh, cross-faced chicken wing on him or something. <laughs> That's right. Who was that? Bob Backlund? Bob Backlund, Bob Backlund. Yeah. Bob Backlund. Yeah. No one's going to know who that is. Yeah, yeah. Right. Um, Bob Backlund, the shortest reign of any champion. What was it? Nine seconds or something stupid? Is that right? Yeah, yeah. 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 There you go. There That's you go. My, 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 my wrestling knowledge ends about 1994, by the way, because I grew up, basically. <laughs> 
Where, where, where's that player from? Um, Gladbach. That's what Liverpool helped the Salas go. <sighs> Thank you. Oh, so, so following on from that, please, um, in the comments, just tell us what wrestling hold you'd like to put in. Your <laughs> right uh, now. <laughs> sharp shooter, cross face, uh, walls of Jericho. Um, I don't know, Cobra else? clutch. Cobra clutch. Camel you have clutch. literally both, lost uh, most both, of the... Both, both the same clutches. I think so. Yeah. Viewership yeah. at this moment. Yeah, no, no. There's, there's 49 people watching as we speak, and they're, they're sticking with us. They like our, our wrestling hold talk. Yeah. <laughs> um, Right, um, Bob Backlund is retired. Former, yeah, yes, someone knows who he is. Thank you, Bear. He's about sixty, um, at least. At least, at least yeah. he's got to be sixty-five. Yeah, yeah. Um, same age as yourself. That's how you know him. I mean, if only someone would have told him six months ago, of, you know, we probably shouldn't be making this move. Um, you know, if it had gone to Ajax from Liverpool six months ago, I think oh. there'd have been a ground swell of support, and there would have been more, like you know. You know, fair play to him for that challenge. You know, moving to a new country at this age, and, yeah. and a, you know, historic club who probably need a little bit of leadership and guidance. But um, the way it's turned out has not been um, not been great. What I would say for him is at least he's been kind of big enough to swallow his pride. They're absolutely flying. To be fair to them, I think Liverpool might sneak a one nil. I see, I I think if Liverpool do win, I'd be very surprised if they don't concede. Yeah, all the I, score I, I a lot agree. of goals. Yeah. So. Two two. Well, I think if Liverpool win, it'll be two one. But I think it'll finish one all. 